Hello, my lovely Capricorn, Sun, Moon, and Rising, and Venus signs. Let's see what's coming out for you, Capricorns. Ooh, I have Emperor energy. All right, so someone is stepping up to the plate um, and wanting to resurrect. This could be someone from your past that's not really have to be here. This could also be a divine masculine coming in um, to straighten some things up with you. I just did Twin Flame readings a few days ago, so definitely check out those readings. Um, this could also be someone you haven't met yet that's manifesting in your life due to some past soulmate connection here in different lifetimes. All right, Capricorns, you're showing up as the Queen of Wands energy, which is beautiful. Like, you're setting goals here. You've dropped some dead weight. Yeah, here comes the chase. As you run, here comes the chase. You're not dealing with it, avoiding conversation, boundaries. You're so angry. You're focusing on yourself. Yeah, I think it was Cancer's energy as well. Like, they're just unbothered, and so are you. You found out some things, and you're you're in your healing phase here, okay? For some of you, you could have found out someone could have had a family or a child, and you're just done. And as you're doing so, as you're focusing on yourself, you're manifesting some new love that's coming in. For those of you, you haven't found out this person had a child or, you know, dealing with some financial um, difficulties here. You could be getting like a drunk text from them. Um, they want to build some long-term uh, stable life with you here, dealing with the earth sign. Knight of Swords, King of Pentacles energy. Um, your wishes will be granted in regards to love that's coming in. I see a strong, independent, emotional, stable king of cups that is coming into your life here. Who's going to be um, emotionally mature. They're going to be mature. They're going to tell you exactly how they feel, their intentions, what they want. And it's because you're dropping the dead weight here. We are a new moon in Leo, or sorry, a full moon in Leo energy that's coming up this weekend. I believe it's Friday, January 26th, whenever you see this reading. So the next two weeks is going to be very strong for you, Capricorns. But I feel like you're already living, you know, your truth here. If something seems suspicious, you're going to find that out. And like I said, it could be a child. It could be an overwhelming, like, mother figure. This person could be giving money to someone else or their child's mother, child's father that they haven't told you about here. Definitely something that they're hiding. And like I said, your intuition is on point. You're going to find this out and potentially block this person, okay? You're just blocking out the BS, Capricorns, and I love that for you. And like I said, as you do this, justice on your side. Someone that you block, they're not talking to you, wants to balance things out with you. But I feel like it's a little bit too late. Yeah, they're watching you. You're watching your socials, thinking about you. If some random music or song or anything that pertains to this person, commercial, movie pops up, it's because this is why. They're like thinking about you like crazy here. They're wondering who you're with. And like I said, a soulmate connection is coming in for some of you Capricorns because you have dead at a situation. You've done the inner work here. And you're going to be blessed with a rewarding love life very soon within the next five weeks. All right, there's a change or shift that's coming in. If you can see the five of cups, the ace of cups, and the five of swords, the fives are in between the A's. So a change is coming in for the better here because you're loving on yourself, okay? There's a new love chemistry that um, is coming in. You're going to instantly click with this person. You could actually meet this person while out having a drink or even like shopping or something crazy like that. You're going to lock eyes and it's going to be instant attraction, all right? And again, that's what this person from your past is really like bothering some, some. They can feel you be literally leaving them behind and here comes the chase with heart-to-heart -heart conversations. It's like, no, I want to talk to you. I want to tell you how I feel. I want to clear some things up. They're hung up over you, Capricorn. So let's see what you need to know at this time. I have, if you could do anything, Capricorns, what would it be? The answer dwells in your heart, not in your mind, for the heart is the gateway to the soul. And give thanks for the blessings of love soon to come your way. Beautiful. Know that you, you deserve to be and have all that your heart truly desires right now. So enough of the isolation mode. Start working on your craft. Have fun. You know, a chapter is trying to close. Do something to clear out your energy right now, Capricorns, and break the chain. You are healing and rewriting your future. I love this. So who or what is triggering you, you know, acknowledge that, let it go. But like I said, someone is going to come in, look at that, black out the noise. Where do you need to establish better boundaries? Because you're being tested right now, okay? You've been training for this for lifetimes, which is why you're beautiful. Feminine energy with the Queen of Wands energy is showing up, okay? I'm not worried about you, Capricorns. You're standing in your true power, and I love that for you. So we pray for unstable Sagittarius to come in here. They're obsessing over you, wondering who you're with. And like I said, for some, they did put you in a third party. But this is all about a lesson in choosing yourself first. Just saw four for four angel number to allow some love to come in here. So let's see if you were to take this person back, okay? 
someone who puts you in a third party energy who's being obsessive now i just feel like they love the run chase aspect where if they give you an inch of um if you give them an inch of your attention they're going to literally take it and run with it so again clean out ron's energy rods in this deck is coming out stand in your power stand in your truth there is a chance that this can potentially work out and reestablish a connection, a stable relationship. They were going through some money issues or just family issues. Um, there is a chance to reconcile, but I feel like eventually, like you're just you're you're gonna be sick of them. You're gonna be like turned off by them, and it's gonna lead to an ending here. I feel like it can last for about two months. Things are gonna balance out, but then you're gonna just kind of feel stuck. Like your hands are gonna be tied to where it's like I don't want to keep dealing with this BS, this in and out energy. So like I said, they're gonna. Um, tell you what you want to hear you know they're going to love the attention that you give them but then a tire moment is going to come in to where i feel like you're going to be like no i'm just going to focus on my money and my goals and kind of leave the situation i feel like you're always going to be the one that got away from this person capricorns and that's just going to be their karma for the time being here so don't take things as a loss take it as a redirection here you're going through a massive transformation and rebirth where your money the love that you want the stability that you want is going to be coming in sooner than you think capricorns i love this for you so playfulness laughter is the best therapy with this new love have some fun together remember have fun with yourself your family your friends and know that love is the greatest healer doesn't always necessarily have to be romantic love here okay i have my beloved this could be a new energy that's trying to come in though we may be physically apart spiritually we are always united for love transcends space and time nothing is missing and your soulmate know that your soulmate is already with you in spirit believe this and they will manifest physically so i own the prize capricorns i have forgiveness stop focusing your energy on past events for life is too precious to waste you create your your yeah your reality by what you think dream and imagine uh, the past is now behind you release and embrace new possibilities a new path is now available to you follow it with faith and trust transformation occurs through acceptance once you accept the current transformation or situation it will automatically transfer in capricorns all right i love this for you stay true to your path and you're going to be all right i'm gonna leave it here guys have a wonderful week